Um, hey, um, I will show you something in Koa uh, about the context. So the con the context encapsulates the nodes uh, request and response response objects into a single object, which provides um, many helpful methods uh, for writing APIs. Um, and a context is created per request, so no matter how many middlewares are applied to the same route, uh, it's only have the same. It's only um, or they are only having the same context, uh, and I'll show you example on this. Um, and if you go here, I will put a link in the description for these two links. Uh, this is called cascading. So when a request hits uh, the Koa server, uh, it only have uh, one context, and this context will be passed down to each middleware. And you can think about it like a stack of, of functions, and th they all have the same context. So. I'll show you, I will show you something that looks similar to this example. So if you remember we defined this route uh, which behaves which uh, fires or or being executed when we hit localhost uh, 3000. It will just put in the body a uh, message hello world as a JSON. So now if we have more routes that maps to the same uh, endpoint which is forward slash for example this one let me copy it and show it to you. And this will just uh, put the X response time uh, from the date. Uh, it's, it's really simple, but this is what uh, this will do. And this will just put inside the body hello world as a string. And now these two won't be activated. Or let me just try. So we'll ju we will just see this hello world. Uh, to make these two activated, uh, they are referenced as the next function here. So you can call it like this. So await next. So this will call the next function on the stack for this endpoint, which is this one, and await set. Then uh, attach the uh, in the body this object. As you can see, we are overriding this here. So if you think about it now. When this endpoint uh, gets hit, we will call the next middleware, which is this one. This one will just calculate the current time and put it here in the, inside the X response time header. And here it will call the next middleware, which is this one. And this will override the body, or at least uh, will put inside the body hello world since this is not being executed yet since we are awaiting the result of these two functions here or to be precise we are awaiting this function and this function is awaiting this function here um, so yeah so at the f at first hello world would be set to the body then when this gets resolved and this is gets re resolved now the body will have message uh, hello world as an object so let me show it to you we will still have the same uh, Response, but if we go to the console, you will see these three lines which we care about. So, first thing we will await the next function, which is this one. This will log the context body, which is undefined at the moment. No function have uh, assigned value there. Then we will await the next function, which will assign value there. So, this will add hello world, and we are console logging that. So, as you can see, after hello world. So this is uh, a way to show you that this is the same context uh, here and here. And if I remove this, now hit refresh, we will see hello world as a string because this is not overriding this value here. So this is called cascading and uh, it's really important uh, to know about. Maybe you can split your uh, uh, middlewares into uh, sorry maybe you can spell as split a single middleware into multiple and they can communicate with each other which with each other like this uh, I'm not sure how I will uh, create the routers yet but I'm sure I will be using this kind of behavior uh, which is called uh, again cascading uh, yeah. I, I thought uh, this is an important thing to say about Koa um, it's actually behaving similar to a framework called feathers. Feathers each request have a single uh, context, and there is an array of functions, array of middlewares, and they all have reference to the same context, which were uh, very useful. 
um, to communicate between middlewares. So yeah. Anyway, thank you.